another great stuff right here in my hands and this is the up to stream pro uh, this is a wi-fi and bluetooth audio receiver board uh, which can be used to upgrade it in your existing sound system which then you can be able to uh, stream music from it directly uh, via your uh, phone app so let me first see what is inside the box and right here is the model itself let me take it out and yeah you have two antennas one is for Wi-Fi and one is for Bluetooth okay I believe this is for Wi-Fi and this is for Bluetooth so here you have the LAN connection uh, the USB port uh, that you can attach the USB key with uh, music uh, stored in and you can then stream it uh, then you have here the audio input and the audio output this is the power connection and the USB power source connection so these are the pins for the LEDs and uh, this is I believe for the digital output yeah and let we try to connect it and see how this thing works so I already pre-made a USB cable with a power only wires inside so uh, I decided to connect it here on the this industrial port uh, like they say so yeah uh, I will just connect it while the red one is uh, 5 volt plus and let me connect like that and let me screw it in like this and like this and here we have the power supplies here is the power adapter uh, which is 5 volt and 1 amp of current so like this and yeah we have the power supply made so let me now connect on the power supply and see how this thing works start yeah and yeah, the white LED is blinking, so we have the Wi-Fi ready, searching, and let me now connect to the Forstream app. And yeah, I forgot to attach, oh, here's, here's searching now for the device, and let me now connect the audio out. Okay, see what will happen still searching yeah I already connect this before so at saying something and now is connected so here we have the up to stream connect via uh, Wi-Fi now you see the uh, white LED is is uh, uh, lighting so it's not blinking anymore and let it try to stream some music now. Let we search. Okay, maybe from tune in my station local radio. Let us see. Oh, so here is the few local radios, and wow, oh. and it's working very fast. So yeah, let me try something else. Malaya. Oh, I don't know what is this. It? Let's try. Oh, nice. Very lot of a uh, lot of possibilities right here. Yeah, great. So Spotify. Again, you need to log in. Then Napster probably log in. Two, yeah, okay. Next one, what is that? I don't know. This there, plugin two. What can be free here? Uh, okay, this is my music stored in the phone and other stuff. Playlists, uh, favorites, of course. Um, you can even search the music again. It's here. Turn in radios. 
Looker, my station. Oh, what is that? New stations, so music. Oh, a lot of music. A lot of music here. Uh, let me see. 19th. And hits. Ah, great. And this is just working straight away. Oh, this tune in is very nice. So, let's see what we got here classic at college radio country music, and let's see what is that. And this really works well. You can manage here the volume and all. Oh, great stuff. I really like that. So, what we have here. here you can set the volume. And even one thing. If you have more of these models, you can pair it together and uh, stream the same music on the all audio devices. So if you have, I don't know, one audio system in a kitchen and other in living room and maybe other in, uh, I don't know, dining room, you can link it together. I think that up to 10 of these and you can all control it here by one app from the phone. And yeah, I forgot to tell you, you can even stream a different music from each module. So if you have a multiple modules, then you can uh, put it here, device on the list, and you will have here another device, and you can here control all the devices and uh, everything. So in every room, you can he hear even different music if you want. So yeah, very good stuff. Okay, if I if you have the another source on the uh, let me say you have connected the line input, then you just click on the line input, and then uh, the system will uh, switch to the uh, your line input. So green LED, and if you put to the Bluetooth, so now Bluetooth activates. Uh, oh. uh, you can even. Uh, find from USB, then I think there is a red light uh, being searching if the USB will be uh, powered in. Let me just quick look on their website. They have really nice labeled everything here, how it all works and uh, what is good for, how what are the features of it and uh, really you will find a lot of useful information here. Uh, even the comparison to the uh, other brands and uh, what you will get for the amount of price that you will pay. Uh, really nice labeled and uh, all the supports and uh, other systems that app has. So how it app work uh, looks like really nice. Uh, so here you have uh, what uh, it all support. So smartphone, tablet, Windows PC, uh, Mac, uh, all devices are supported. You can find in uh, the app in the App Store and uh, in the Google Play for the Android. So uh, and yeah, that that I mentioned uh, that uh, if you have multiple. Uh, of these modules you can then stream the same music or the different kind of music but all from the same app here you have uh, all the spats you will need all if, if you have any questions you have here the answered questions how to use it uh, really nice they really try to do a good uh, the best as they can to user so really really i think that really they made great stuff products and even the products look very very high quality so yeah i hope that i bring you a little bit closer to this device and uh, sorry for my english uh, but I hope that you understand the basics of this device. So, thank you and see you in next review.